What's up everybody? The weekend is almost here and stay with us because we got something exciting for you. Well, right now we are outside of Rocky Mount, North Carolina. And as you see, we are traveling. And we've got three families heading down for a week. We're stopping off in South Carolina. And after that, you'll see where we're going. So stick with us, enjoy the adventure. See you guys in a little bit. Okay, everyone, we finally made it to our first destination. At 12.50, no, what time we get here? Midnight. So. Now mind you, what time we leave? 5.48 this morning we left. It was supposed to be a nine hour trip. The nine hour trip turned into a 17 hour trip trip <laughs> Se 17 hours 17 hours okay so we said we were going to take you on an adventure well it was an adventure all right not a hundred percent good so we're gonna break it down for you start off baby okay so there were three rvs one of them broke down which is again it's fine things happen we all were very cool all day. It's how we were treated that really ticks me off. Yes. The first call they made, the guy said that they were going to be there in 20... An hour to 40 minutes. Oh, an hour to 40 minutes. Yeah, 40 minutes to an hour. Two hours later, he calls back and says, Oh, sorry, I didn't realize that there was a tire change in front of you. So then we wait a little bit more. Then he calls back again and says, Oh, there's four tire changes in front of you. Yep. Are you kidding? So then we've been sitting there. We got there about what time? We're about noon. And we still didn't hear anything. So what time did you guys try to start to fix it yourself? We tried to fix it ourselves probably around three or four. Uh, got almost everything done, but there was one part that we couldn't get off. Um, but not only that, we had called another guy and he said, well, I can come out there, but it's going to cost you $300. Just to look. Just to look at it. Hell, I, I can do that. guarantee that I can fix it. Y'all need something? Just call me. I'll come take a look at it and I'll do it for, I'll do it better. I'll, I'll, I'll do it for $200. Yeah. Just come take a look at it. So, needless to say, uh, we got here <clears> at midnight. It's been a long, long day. We're a little tired. But, you know, that is, that's what happens in the, or with the RV lifestyle. Things happen. You just have to make the best of it. You know? And we did. Everybody was just as chill. I mean, everybody was good. And that's what I loved about traveling with this group. Um, me, I'm not a big fan of road trips. I don't know if I ever told you guys about that. Even in a car, my shelf life is about four, four and a half hours tops. <laughs> and that includes even on a plane. Like I can't do, I just don't do well. My legs start, I just start to feel like crap. So this was the first road trip that I've taken. We took one with two years ago, right? Well, where? Myrtle Beach. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That was Myrtle Beach. Two or and, three years ago. And, but then we stopped halfway here. Okay, so, um... I'm, we're gonna let you guys know how the rest of the trip went now the rest of us still aren't here yet and it is almost one o'clock in the morning and I'm not even sure how many hours they have left because they had another 
had to make a detour and go someplace else to drop someone else off. Um, so I know they're really, really tired. Yep. So we're going to continue on our journey. We're going to get up in the morning and uh, get all set up and move on to the second leg of our trip. Right? That's right. So we will see you guys in the morning. See, and that's the good, the bad, and the ugly, because I know I look a hot mess. All right, good night. <laughs> night, night. So, good morning, everyone. We are in Yamasi. Hope I'm pronouncing that correctly. South Carolina at the Point South KOA. This is just a stop off point on our trip for this holiday season. So, I'm headed up to the camp store to see what they have there. And if you look around, it's a quaint little campground, a lot of trees. The pool. There's our rig there. Looks like a lot of people have gotten up early and headed out for the day. So follow me as we go inside the camp store to see what they have. See you in a minute. All right, so I'm headed back to the rig and the correct pronunciation for the location is Yemasi. Yemasi, South Carolina. All right, see you guys in a few. Hello everybody, we are back on the road after we talked about our adventure yesterday on the way down. It is now 2.06, so we've been on the road for about two hours. So we're headed down, but take a look at this weather. Yeah, it's just lovely outside, isn't it? <laughs> so hopefully it'll get better when we reach our destination. Yep. What, are, what are your thoughts, David? Destination two coming up in a few hours. Uh, but in all actuality, I'm having a good time. Not sure about everybody else. Me too. Right. You kids having a good time? Yeah! <laughs> okay, we will see you guys later. Bye. Hello everybody. We've reached our Christmas vacation destination and both the grandkids did so well. I don't have a uh, little man with me right now, uh, but I've got this one. How'd you make out doing the trip? I was very bored. <laughs> very bored. <laughs> and was really bad. Actually, I thought you did very well. Well, I hit it. You hit it? Well, you did very well, and thank you for hiding it. She did very good. <laughs> so, um, you, in order for you guys to find out where we're at, you got to watch next week's video. So, here's hoping you have a wonderful weekend. Bye. Bye. Whoa, oh, oh. Da, 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 da. Whoa, oh, oh. Da-da-da-da, oh-oh, da-da-da-da, making our Christmas.